Gotta get it in between the toes. Ah! <laughs> okay. I think this doesn't work. Oh my, these stink bad. See, Roberta? Mm -hmm. Like I'm making a pasta with a Roberta. There we go. I hope this doesn't ruin my sweater. I love this sweater. So earlier today I was talking with Roberta and we were joking and just talking about all of the funny traditions that we have in America and in Spain and she mentioned something that was really funny to me. In Spain, if you drink water that's cold and you're cold hot, water, yes. then what happens? You die. You die? Yeah, you <laughs> die. I, I drink cold water all the time and I don't die. But I've also heard someone say that it can get you sick. You've, have you heard that one? It can give you like a cold. Yeah. So as you guys know, we are partnering with Mucinex this cold season. So big thanks to Mucinex for collaborating with us and sponsoring this video. And we just thought it would be a really good time to talk about the 10 most creative cold remedies that we found online and just in our countries. So one of our favorite cold remedies at our house is the Children's Mucinex Multi-Symptom Cold in Very Berry Flavor. It is number one pediatrician recommended cold and cough medicine and it takes care of the nasty phlegm and the coughs and we just love this product so it's basically our go-to for this time of year but we want to talk to you guys about some of these other remedies as well so also i just need to tell you guys that these 10 remedies we're about to try are not scientifically proven and obviously we're not physicians so we're just trying them to have fun but we'll see how they work actually some of them sound really weird so let's see if they are helpful in any of these situations. We might need a little bit of help from the rest of the kids. So number 10 on, you're getting <laughs> sick. So number 10 is rubbing vaporizing rub on the bottom of your feet and putting socks on. Rubbing what in what? This is one that my mom would always do to us. Every time when I was a little kid, if we got sick, she would slather the vaporizing rub on our feet. <laughs> and then do the socks. Smell it. Uh, 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 no, no. I think... You gotta I smell it. Keep it for your Why grandma. You uh, uh. <laughs> Does that feel nice, Embry? Mm -hmm. Roberta, let me see your feet. What? No! I thought it was only Daisy and Embry. No, you gotta try it too. Why? Because you're sick, you've been coughing all day. <laughs> gotta make sure we try all the remedies. <laughs> ah, that feels so weird. Are you ticklish? I think she's ticklish. You gotta get it in between the toes. Ah! <laughs> okay, calm down. Evie likes it. Hi, Evie. Is that funny, Evie? Yeah, Berta. Berta. <laughs> Smell. Kind of has mint bacon. Smell. Do you like it? <laughs> Is it veins or something? Uncle, I don't Uncle. like it. I think maybe oh, it's nerves. supposed to absorb into your skin. Oh my Honestly, I think all it does is just kind of make your... So you're your... questioning how this works, but you're accepting that drinking cold water kills a king. Okay, you're think about that. it. If your body's warm and you suddenly put a cold in it, your body can like... Die! Your body temperature like <laughs> goes like this, so you start getting a high fever and then you die. Okay. okay. All right. Okay, coming in at number nine is wearing an onion in a sock around your neck. Do you want to try that one, Ralph? Uh-uh. If you think that smells bad, wait till I cut it. So I actually yeah. just saw this on the internet. And I think it said we had to chop up the onion. I've never actually tried this. Okay, here we go. There we go. You feeling good? Oh, uh, I, I can smell it. Let's squish it a little bit. Ah! Uh, yeah, you stink, girl! Ah, uh, I think I'm gonna cry with this smell. Do you think it works? Or do you think this is just an old wives tale? I think this doesn't work. Oh my, you stink bad. Yeah, because I have onions in my neck. <laughs> no one should do this. Oh, Roberta. Is it working? Is your nose getting See if Evie will running? give you a hug. Let's see if Evie will give Evie you a hug. Are you going to have a hug? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we just decided this is just a smelly mess and it's gross, so let's take it off. Sorry, Rivers. <laughs> I bet it works better if you cook the onions. Okay, let's try that. I'm gonna try cooking the onions for a minute in the microwave. Maybe if they're hot, they'll work better. Can you smell them? Yes. It smells like dinner. It smells so good. You can see like heat coming off. Like 
It just stings like stinky socks. Try, try that. The steam might help. <laughs> mm -mm. I can already see my eyes crying. <laughs> uh, 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 mm -mm. Coming in at number eight is drinking hot turmeric milk. Is that how you say it? Turmeric? I have never ever heard of this. I just found it on the internet as one of like a weird remedy. <laughs> and so I'm gonna try making it. I found a recipe and I'm gonna taste, I've never tasted this before and we're gonna give it a taste. I have a bunch of spices here. This is kind of a lot of work, I'm not gonna lie. You ready to try this like a herb base right now? <laughs> <laughs> that sounds gross. <laughs> so it's just baking like she's drinking. Ah, uh, it tastes like old person. <laughs> Does it taste yeah. like a grandpa? Yes. <laughs> You should make your dad try it. He's downstairs. <gasps> yeah. So let's let's have you guys try taste it. it and see what mm -hmm. see what you think. He likes it. I like it. I told you you should make him try it. I was like, this tastes no, like it's grandpa's. Good. <laughs> it's actually no, good. it's really good. You like it too? What? Yeah, you can have the rest if you want. <laughs> Remedy number seven is to use a sock with rice in it and heat it up in the microwave to make your own heat pack. And I actually heard of this one. Yeah. Yeah. Davy's mom always uses hot packs. I'm going to make one really quick just to show you how fast it is. Good job. Now get some more. <laughs> how long is this sock? <laughs> He's busy. You wanna make sure you never give this to kids if it's too hot to hold on to for like a whole minute. It's a little too hot right now, so I'm gonna let it cool down. So weird. <laughs> what the heck was that? You're supposed to put it on the kid's chest. Do you like this rice pack I made? She just wants to play with it now. I have my own warm dog well, bag. If you have a dog, you can do that too. <laughs> So number six is put your face over hot steam. So we have some hot boiling steam here. Not me. Uh -uh. Don't look at me. Oh yeah, you're the one coughing, girlfriend. Here, here's a towel. I actually have seen people doing this in movies. Okay, don't touch the bowl, it's hot. Okay. <laughs> ah, this feels so weird, like it's burning my face. Well then get further away. <laughs> <laughs> Just kind of right here is the area. It's like onions, why does it smell like onions? I don't know, maybe because you stink. Ah, <laughs> uh, maybe. Right there, right there. Don't get too close. There you go. I you feel like it's to breathe. It helps to breathe? Yeah. It's clearing out your lungs, like opening your lungs? Yeah, but my eyes hurt. Close it your eyes. It smells like onions. Uh, did you put onion in the water? No. It's actually it's good you. to breathe. You smell I think, no, onion. there's onions there! Oh. <laughs> The onion smell gave me an idea. We should put some herbs, like rosemary and oregano and thyme in there. I think it smells good. See? See, Roberta? Mm -hmm. Like I'm making a pasta with Roberta. <laughs> <laughs> now I just want spaghetti so bad. I want to stay here. Number five is eating raw garlic. Okay, Davey's gonna try to eat this whole entire clove of garlic, and I think you should try one too. Eating raw garlic? Okay, here we go. Here, you hold it. Maybe just you've never done it, then it pops up. Okay, here we go. No, honey, oh, not that! Yeah. Not that! That's a paper! <laughs> I, it's this one. No, you can't, you can't, no, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> What would you do in Spain if you started feeling sick? Like what natural like, remedy would you try? Like hot lemon tea. Okay. So to make it even more honey and lemon, you're gonna add a little bit of lemon and honey. Milk tastes better. Okay, put some milk in yours. That's what you would do. More honey than milk. Ugh. Oh my, Ooh, it's curdling. <laughs> Looks okay. so gross. I think this is too hot. Get a close up of hers. It looks like cottage cheese in there. <laughs> it's so gross. Cheers. 
I love it. It's soothing. It's good. <laughs> like milk taste it's good. a I don't even taste milk. It's just weird. Ooh, the next one is my favorite one. This is one my grandma always did. She always had, she's from Germany. She always had the salty black licorices. So these are the little licorices my grandma would always give us. Try one. They're so good. Mm. What is this? It's salty licorice. <laughs> I can see how this is kind of like a cough drop. I like it. Let's see if the other kids like it. Okay, on the count of three, everyone's gonna try it. Amber, get one? Yeah. Roberta already tried one. Uh -oh, okay. Oh. On your mark, get set, go. Chew it. Do you love it? No. Told ya. I think you have to He's suck like, it. Oh, 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 look. It's really hard. Oh, oh, oh. Told ya. It's like way over salty liquor. See? Oh, oh, another one. Oh, oh. I told you. She has it way over, over Do you like it? Is it yummy? This one is really, really weird. It's taking a bath with ground mustard. And they do this in Russia, and then they get under a warm blanket. So like, you get out of the bath and quickly get under a warm blanket, and it's supposed to make you feel all cozy and warm. Do you wanna try it? Tell me I'm not doing that. We'll have Zay do it. <laughs> I wanna do it. That's actually sort of relaxing. Hurry, the warm blanket's getting cold. I put it in the dryer. And then wrap your suit in that. And then, warm blanket, turn around. Okay, go lay down. Oh, this is really warm. Doesn't that feel great? I feel like I'm getting some kind of spa treatment. I'll give it two warm thumbs up. All right, number one, Roberta, is wearing wet socks. Really cold, wet socks put on after your feet have been soaking in hot water and then covered with hot wool socks or dry wool socks and then you get into bed, it's supposedly your feet do all the work and like pull all the toxins out of your body. So we'll see. This first part sounds really nice. You just put your feet in really hot water. Well, that's really hot water. All right, my feet are nice and hot. So now I'm gonna put on the really cold, wet socks. This is so weird. Oh, and they're hard to get on because they're wet. Oh my gosh, that's really cold. And then the dry wool socks. Ow. My feet are getting the whole house wet. Oh, me. <laughs> oh, and we're going backwards. <laughs> ah! Oh! <laughs> Good night. I'll see you in the morning without a cold. All right, you guys, I hope you liked these remedies. I personally didn't love all of them, but I did love the licorice. Um, the steam was nice. The steam was nice. And what was the other one that you liked? Oh, I like the oh, honey tea. Yeah, that was, that good. was good. Comment below and let me know if you've tried some of these. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Um, children's multi-symptom mucinex and very, very flavor is still our favorite cold remedy around our house and we stock up on it every year. And thanks again to Mucinex for sponsoring and working with us on this video. And thank you to Roberta for being such a good sport because she doesn't like eating things. Mm -mm. <laughs> Very good sport. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>